Michelle and Cat and Cloud and Coconut Dreaming English. And today we're going to talk about the summertime. Do that again, Bunny. This summertime, as I had said. So basically, it's gonna be the first day of summer soon. When the sun is going to be out a lot more. And since it's gonna, it's be, gonna the first, be hot. So the temperature in summer begins to rise and go up more and what happens is that we start doing different things during summer because there's no school and there's no school so we go outside a lot so we we go outside Alright, we just put the bunnies away. So basically, uh, what I was saying is that we go outside a lot more because even though it's hot, we can go swimming in the water. Okay. Okay, thumbs up. Three, two, two one. And that will so we can go swimming, and that will cool us down. So then it gets so outside. They're also at nighttime when the moon comes out. It gets a lot cooler, and even though it's warm, it's not as humid. So the, so we're not as sweaty. Yeah, so it's very for it's very it's very nice weather, so it's good so it's really nice to have fires. We also we like going on camping trips. like to go and we also we like to go camping so sometimes we'll stay in a camper which is basically like a tent but kind of on it's wheels like a tent on wheels and you can see a picture of our camper below us mm -hmm. and we also like doing we also sometimes for some camps, we stay, we would stay inside of a tent. We used to stay in tents. Now yes. we've been using the camper since we got it recently. We, when we stayed in tents, it rained a lot and we got wet. Very wet. So and you can see really, pictures of that below. So we don't really stay in tents as much anymore. Because mm -hmm. I, I don't like to get wet. There was one camp like that wet, we... So there's one camp that we do like a lot that we go inside of cabins. The particular cabin that we go inside of is called Onida. And it's that and we really like going to that camp too. And that's called Beckett. Yes. We've probably talked about it before. Mm -hmm. And we also like going to the beach. go swimming except not in a pool in the ocean we like to swim in the ocean at the beach more of in the ocean with the fishies and we also when we go outside we go outside to play more with the bunnies and we usually do all these things this summer though we're not going to be going camping 
and we're not going to the beach. We're not going to the beach because we are in quarantine with the coronavirus. So some of the things that we can do is have campfires in our backyard mm -hmm. at night time. At night time, and we can we can swim in our pool. We can swim in our pool, but we can't have you can no see fish swimming a around. Picture in our below feet. of our pool, which right now it's not working, but hopefully soon. We had a little problem with the pump that moves that water around. Yeah, and we can still go outside with the bunnies. And we can go on hikes. Uh, At different public trails. Mm -hmm. And yeah, summer can still be fun even though we are in quarantine. Mm -hmm. But also during summer, we would go with our friends. Like sometimes I would have played it with some of my friends. And one of us, so basically I would come so let's say this is my house here. It's a little bit small, but mm -hmm. I would go from my house all so the way go. over to- We usually would drive there. Yeah. To my friend's house and we'd visit each other. But now that can't really happen either because we have to stay inside of the house. Mm -hmm. So right now to be having some time with friends, Katerina is going on the phone and talking with her friends with messenger and stuff yeah so what I do is my mom set up messenger kids so I have some contacts of some of my other friends including miles from some of the other videos and it's really nice because I at least get to talk to some of my friends while we're doing that yeah. And, and sometimes we went to a parking lot and they were bike riding, not bike riding like this, but bike riding, but they were staying six feet apart while they were bike riding. And we'll put some pictures about that below too. So you have to stay six feet apart while biking. Mm hmm And when we're on the trails, when other people are walking, we have to kind of move over to the side and make sure that we stay six feet apart. And there are signs, I'll have a picture below, that show to stay six feet apart when we go on the trails. So we'll be going down the trail, that Katarina drew the picture, and we're going down. And then we need to get over to the side when there's other people coming. That's you, Mom, apparently. Oh, that's me, huh? I don't know. Okay. My head is very large. And I also look like I have no idea where I am or what I'm no. doing. And we have some really nice trails. We have trails with waterfalls. As you can see in mm -hmm. that picture below. Mm -hmm. And what else did we see on the trails? We saw, oh, we saw beaver dams. And so there's a lot of nice trails that are not far. We drive a little bit, maybe about 15 minutes. We went to this one, what, this one, trail in a place called Paxton and it had a really big waterfall and it had some really steep trails so we went up the steep trail and we were at the top of the waterfall fall so we're gonna show a picture of the waterfall here mm -hmm. right below and it and as you can see from the picture, it may not look as big as it is because you can't see a human scale, but this is a picture of me climbing it because when we went to the top, we were on top of the rocks right here. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's pretty much what we do in that's the summer. That's what we usually do in the past summers and what we're going to be doing this summer. Yeah, so... Uh, what, do you, what do you do um, in the summertime? Let us know in the comments below. And meanwhile, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.